right here in North Texas to celebrate a historic event. SMU will dedicate George W. Bush's presidential library. Our own Stephanie Lucero is live on the campus in University Park with a closer look at the center's impact. Stephanie. Well, Brendan and Adrian, the George W. Bush Presidential Center will be a magnet for all types of people, for researchers, for students of all ages, and really for people all over the world. With me now live is Tony Fratto, the Deputy Press Secretary for President George W. Bush during that administration, and you were also the Assistant Secretary to the Treasury. During the end of President Bush's administration, there was a financial crisis. Tell me about that era and what you'd like to see portrayed here. Yeah, I think we're so it's still dealing with a lot of that today. I think it would be an opportunity for a lot of people to come here and think about a lot of the decisions that were made and made during the transition at that time with uh, the Bush administration and the Obama administration dealing with the crisis that impacted the, uh, the entire economy. We were dealing with a lot of economic issues for the beginning of the Bush, Bush administration until the very last day. So this will be a place for study and to think about those decisions and the impact that they had for, on the American people and the U.S. economy. And specifically, we were talking about the passing of the baton between the two administrations. W what are your thoughts about that? Well, it was an amazing time. This was probably uh, one of the more remarkable transitions for uh, two administrations. They, they, you know, really consequential time with the wars in Iraq and Afghanistan and the financial crisis taking place all at the same time. And it was a, a, a really impressive opportunity for all of us to work together and to make sure that transition went as smoothly as possible so that the baton could be handed off uh, in a very successful way. And I think we're, we're all very proud of that. Okay, a lot of history, a lot of history will be portrayed here and the official dedication will get underway at 10 a.m. tomorrow. Live in University Park, Stephanie Lucero, CBS 11 News. All right, thank you so much, Stephanie.